Your Your Highness, it's exactly 20 minutes or thereabout since I stepped into this noble palace, only to meet you in this speechless state. This is quite unusual. I don't need to be told that all is not well. I know you are troubled. Your Highness, I'm your closest conf confidant. Why don't you speak to me? Let me know what the problem is. My heart is heavy. My roof is crashing in. In a week's time, I am supposed to present my first son to the people. I do not have a son to present. I don't seem to, seem to understand your highness. What about John? John? Yes, your highness. Mm. John has become a thorn in my flesh. He has turned himself into a monster, a pathetic womanizer and a drunk. Tell me, how can I present such a stupid son to the people? Where is the former? My prince, I'm sorry. I'm Why sorry. are you sleeping out here at this time? My prince, I was just, I'm, I'm just tired. I'm, I'm so sorry. You are tired? Yes, my prince. And then you decided to sleep outside? I am really sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Be sorry for yourself. Go upstairs, pick the clothes in my room and get them washed before me. Okay, my prince. Hey! You must get pick this. Okay. I'm sorry. Go! Okay. This is the reason you neither pick my calls, nor want to see me. Sandy, don't start nagging here, okay? <sighs> so, John, Sandy now nags. No, not John. Prince John to you. Oh, whatever. And you, Harlot, what are you doing with my man? How dare you call me an Harlot? Are you mad? Oh, shut up. What are you? A common Harlot. You're Sandy, mad. What you are. Can you stop this? <laughs> Behave yourself, I'll have you thrown out. I mean it. You have me thrown out for her. John, is this it? After all that we shared together? My prince, I thought you promised to love me forever. That was in the past. We've had fun, get over it. This is the present, I don't see you in my present. All I see is um, his dreadlocks here with green eyes. So it's over because of her? Anyway. So John, you used me and now you want to dump me. No, 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 no. Use is relative. How do you define use? Use my credit card at will, spent money everywhere, use my connections, my cars, my houses. What did I use? Your body. I gave you, you took. You gave me, I took. We used each other. What are you talking about, use? I don't blame you. But one thing is certain. You must regret this. Hey, hey. I know oh, that shut bag. up. I know that bag. You probably bought that bag with my money to you cheap as hell. Your shoes too. Almost everything you're wearing. <laughs> Can you believe that girl? I don't think I can stand this. Where are you going? Oh wait, if that one gives me problems, you two will give me problems. Sit your fake ass down. 
even if you a boot toxin everywhere you want to start you know. friends sit down that was my past walking away you can join her if you like I said sit down let's discuss your thick eyes and the dreadlocks and other things by the way where do you into boot talks in this body of yours trust me I will remember what you look like in two minutes <laughs> Everything all right, before my I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Are you sure you're okay? Yes. Ah. I don't think she's okay. I don't think she's okay. Tell me you're angry. Come on, she likes to rant a lot. It's not my fault. Somebody had to give her a taste of her medicine. I don't like guys that treat women like rags. I don't treat women like rags. I adore women. Do I treat you like a rag? I, I take good care of you, don't I? Are you sure? Would you love me for real? Baby, I love you for real. I love everything about you. I love the Botox hacks, the Botox sleeves. I love the dreadlocks, the green eyes. I... Listen, okay. I may not agree with your fashion sense, but hey, that's love, right? People have to differ. Right? Let's toast. To present day love. <laughs> I heard you've been looking for me all over the palace. What is it? Yeah, sorry. I've been looking for you everywhere. I uh, wanted to tell you that I... That I... Uh, I... That you are what? Talk? I don't have all day. I am pregnant. What? How? How? How did it... What are we going to do? I don't know. I told you. I want you to stay clear of me, but you refused. I warned you. You know what, Ifoma, please. Um, let this be between us. No other person should hear this. Let me just think, uh, think of a solution, okay? Uh, no, 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 bro. This is simply not fair. You can't practically abandon Sandy like that. She, this girl loves you with her heart, and you know it. I love her too in my own way. My heart, it's just that my, my love is big enough to go around. That's what you don't understand. 
I, I need to, I, that girl can't hold me down. Sandra was feeling like a caged bird. You no, know? so I, need, I needed to open the cage and let her go so another bird can come in. <laughs> Get the ideology. See, I, I know you too well, okay? I know you too well. But in this case, Sandy is not worth breaking her heart. That girl is, you know, I think you're making a mistake anyway. No, I don't think so. You see, that girl, that girl wasn't happy. And I just had to liberate her, you know? I'm, I'm a player. I need to, you know, the ball is moving now. I need to keep my eye on the ball. You can't, you can't be a striker and you're standing in one position. No, it doesn't happen that way. How will you score goals? Hmm? You need to ask Messi, ask, ask the greats, ask, ask Pelez, you know? Ask, ask, ask the princess, you know? It has to, you, have, you have to move with the ball. Bro, seriously, you need to have a rethink. No, I'm not rethinking anything. Let, let me tell you, you know, check Tonya, for instance. Now, you know, I've been going down this Egusi soup lane for a while. I want to try the okra soup, get slippery a bit. Because, you see, there's something bohemian about that girl. Tonya is the kind of girl people will say, why did he go there? Because, check it out, check, check the mix. The, the, the bohemian thing she has going for her, the, the, the dreadlocks, the, 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 the fake green eyes, the Botox ass, the Botox boobs. You know, that, that funny, the fashion mishap, yeah, all those things. You know, it's the confluence of all those things that attract me. You know, I, I want to go that way. Let people wonder what is Prince doing there. You know, so that we'll generate controversy. That's the whole idea. You know, provoke debate. No, but uh, you, you, you get me surprised. And I'm, I see uh, this qualities you just analyzed now was exactly what you told me when you met Sandy. That's what keep attracting me to them. You don't understand. You know, listen. Don't blame me. I'm just a player. Hit the game. I'm, hey, I'm just a striker, man. I want the trophy. I know, no, no, I know you enjoy these things. You like the fact they come to you like a well of wisdom, trying to conquer the unconquerable. <laughs> Tell them I'm a liar. My king, this is terrible. Now, what are you going to do? I don't know. I have asked God repeatedly. Why it should be my time that this will happen? The throne had been in our family from the time of our, my great great grandfathers. Yes, I know it. But I wonder why it is in my time a king will be sought for and not found. Well, <sighs> Your Highness. There is no problem without a solution. You have another son, don't you? Yes. Our tradition demands to present a son to them. The law did not specify the first son. Think about it, my king. Yes. Yes. Okay. What do you want me to do about this pregnancy? I can't hide it for too long. The only option now is abortion. What? An abortion? Yes. I can't have an abortion. I can't do it. You cannot kill the baby either. Who is going to take care of it? I can't do it. I mean, it's more that it's a sin before God. That is the only way out. Mention my name anyway. Because if you do, God save you. God save you. That's money. Go and have the abortion, then go to the village and get some rest. I've told you, I can't do it. I can't have an abortion. The former in your interests, go and flush that thing. I can't do it. It's a sin before God. I can't do it. I can't. I can't. Okay. I've given you one. Sit yourself. <sighs>
think. Just a little. Mm -hmm, that's okay. Thank you. Um, Your Highness, there is something I want to tell you. What is it? Um, Your Highness, I, I would like to go and see my mother in the village. You are permitted. How long are you staying? I'll be staying for two weeks. Two weeks? Yes, Your Highness. That is, that is too long. Anyway, anyway, you can go. You can go. Thank you so much, Your Highness. Thank you. And greet your people for me. I will. Your Majesty. <laughs> the king of our kingdom. The king that knows the heart of his people. The chosen one of the gods. The man of the people. I greet you. Akunne, my king, son of Ndagora. Thank you, my king. You are welcome to my palace. Thank you. Please sit. Akunne, <laughs> my king. I called you. Yes. You know, it will be four days before the presentation of the prince to the people. Yes. Akunne. My king. I have decided to present my second son, Okenna, to the people. <laughs> you have made the wise decision. I give you my full support. You have always supported me. <laughs> Yeah, uh, you are welcome. Let yeah. me look for this guard. Oh, it's yeah. okay, it's okay. There's Let no them problem. get you. Uh, no problem. Um, you're packing already? Yes, I am. Ufama, the best thing for you to do is to have this abortion and then go to the village and rest. I have heard you. Fine. I hope the money I gave you will be enough. Yes. Your father gave me more money. Oh, good. Good then. Go well. The king and the, his son. Well, they are fine. They asked of you. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm so uh, happy. I'm so, let's go inside. Mama, I have something for you. I bought Me? a gift for you. Be, I can't yeah. wait to see it. Yeah, Mama, you're too good. Look at you, Mama. Look at you, Mama. Are you okay? 
I'm okay. I was just lost in thought. It's nothing serious. I'm fine. Okay, if you say so. Yeah. Um. On Saturday, I'll be presenting the crown print to the people. On Saturday. Yes. Is John aware? Because he doesn't seem to be prepared. I am not presenting you. I'm presenting you. Why me? Father John is the first son. Yes, I know. But John is not worthy for that throne. I have chosen you as the crown heir to the throne. So, okay now. Begin to get ready for Saturday. The younger one will take your place, I pray. Sit now and think for the future of the land. Sit back and wonder the kind of king you'll be. Since you came back, you've been moody. What happened? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for disappointing you. I'm really sorry. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. You are sorry for disappointing me? How? Were you sent out of the palace? Yeah? Hey, for me, we move. Hey, former, what did you do? Yeah? So you want me to go back to my poor condition? We all know to inform me why now. Mama. You went to the palace and forgot where you came from. Hi. Mama. Mama, why are you? Mama, I'm pregnant. I'm sorry, I'm pregnant. You're what? I'm pregnant. Ifoma. How? Who got you pregnant? One of the king's son. Hey! Hey, for my why? Hi! I'm sorry, I'm sorry that I disappointed you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry for you. Oh, it's time for us. Go ahead and pull out, Ifoma. I'm sorry. They deceived me, they deceived me. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> if I'm, I have finished. Why now? Why did you do this to me? If I'm, I'm Mama, why? <laughs> Mama, he wanted me to abort the pregnancy. He even gave me some money. But I couldn't do it. Thank God he did not do it. You are a child of God. Mama, Mama, what do we do now? I can't go back to the palace pregnant. The king must be informed about the new developments. The king will hate me. He will hate me forever. He wouldn't like it at all. But we must go. We can't. We must go and see him. Eh? Let's tackle it at once. Was not forward. So uncomfortable. I can't. I can't bend over completely. You know. I, I, I don't know. I, I really fear the worst. Mm. No, that's nothing serious. It's nothing to worry your head over. No, no, no. This is something. I don't know if I've contacted a, a STD or something. I, 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 it's just, just very uncomfortable. No, I. I don't think so. But to clear your worries, I'm going to run some tests. Yeah. The sooner the better because this is not funny. No matter if I hindered my last performance, if you know what I mean. My goodness. 
Why are you tensed? You don't need to worry yourself. Besides, I've always warned you about this girls and your reckless attitude with them. Listen, it's nothing. I just want to make sure I'm fine. I don't... At this stage, I can't, I can't deal with this disease. It's not for me. Bro, it is real. Well, life is real too, Ben. Just because you're not living doesn't mean we can't live it. So because it's real, I, I can't bore. My guy, listen, hit the game, not the player. Right? I'm just doing my part to make the women happy. Your Highness. That is why I followed her, so I will talk to you myself. I, this is very, very disgraceful act, if only. Yeah. I have so much love and confidence in you. Why did you do this? Your Highness, I am really sorry. I am so sorry. Which of my sons did this? Which one? I am sorry. How dare you disgrace me? Huh? What are you slapping me for? How dare you? Your Highness. No, no, no. He's not the one. He, he's not the one, Your Highness. He's not the one. I'm not the one that did what? He's not the one? Yes, Your Highness. What did I do? Okay, now. Nah. Okay, now. Nah. Yes, Your Highness. It's okay, now. Nah. Hey! Hey! I'm sorry. Okay, now nah has killed me. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, no, 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 no,
Okay now. Hey! Listen to yourself. A Christian like you? Making suggestions as to commit murder? No. No. You cannot bring shame to my name. You cannot bring dishonor to this royal house. You must marry Ifoma. That, that decision cannot stand. I can't be made to get married to someone when I'm not ready for it. Oh, you didn't think about that before going to get her pregnant? You must marry her! Never! I can't marry you! I will never get married! I have spoken! Dad! Oh. Your Highness! What Your is this? Dad? Oh. Hey! Dad! What is it? Your Highness! Your Highness. Oh, my heart is broken The kind of son you are I have fears untold The kind of life you live If only I could Turn the no. time around Younger uh, I'm better off today than before It's good to know mm. I brought you something to eat I'm not in the mood for any junk now I know it is naughty for mother cooked that food And for the other maids, they do not know how to cook Well it's not junk dad, it's well prepared Where did you buy it from? I didn't buy it. I cooked it myself, especially for you. You mean you cooked for me? <laughs> Thank you, my son. <laughs> it's okay, Father. Oh, I'm so happy about this. I can see you purposely allowed yourself to get pregnant so as to lure me to marry you. I told you that I never wanted this. I never wanted it. Your plans have failed. I didn't want this, but you kept coming to me. I didn't want it. So why didn't you abort it like I told you? I, can't I even gave you money. I can't use my hands to kill an innocent baby. I can't do it. I can't. That thing in your tummy is not a baby yet. Just clots of blood. Go and flush it. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't. You can't do it. I can't. Oh. I can't. You're your own. Because I can't marry you. Please, please. With my lips, I will never. I don't want this. Please, why are you doing this to me? I don't want you to die. I never wanted it at all. Never sat before for you. I cannot force your son to marry my daughter. What happened cannot be changed. I have decided to... Listen, Mugu. Okenna is my son. He lives under my own roof. And he cannot do otherwise. But, Your Highness, I wouldn't want the young man to fail we are forcing him into he marriage. He must marry a former... That is my decision, and it stands. Thank you, Your Highness, for being fair to me. Thank you so much. If Oma is a good girl, and she'll be the dream of any young man. What kind of son does this to his father? What kind of devil has taken hold of him? Sit down and think for the future of the land. Sit back and wonder the kind of king you'll be. In Azahamo, Manye Mobi Mwawa, Ibo Bala. My prince, your food is ready. Get out of here! Are you dumb? Out! Sorry, sorry, my prince. What's all the back info? You have a minute? Cool, cool. <clears throat> so, 
So, um, are you going to listen to the voice of reasoning from a very unlikely quarter? Or you want to smoke yourself to death? John, say what you have to say, please. Very well. Listen, I know I'm prying. It's none of my business. I think you should marry for me. You can't have each other to wedlock. Hmm? I've told you guys I can't marry that girl. It's the right thing to do, bro. She's a good girl. And we need to give her and her child a home. The scandal will be a little too bad for the kingdom. We're here. Okay, so why don't you go ahead and marry her yourself? I didn't do the deed. You did. So you should bear responsibility. You pumped her, not me. John, if you don't mind, I'd like to think. In other words, I should get lost, huh? So yes, you don't have anything to say. Let me let me think. Well. Think about it, okay? Some of us are not that lucky. Have you made up your mind on marrying that girl? But I've told you severally, I cannot marry that girl. Listen. Listen to me, Okemo. Okay? You must marry that girl. If you refuse marrying her, I will cut off all financial and social support you get from me. I will even make you irrelevant in the palace. Why? Dad, are you threatening me? Threatening you? I am telling you what I am going to do from henceforth, and you are talking of threatening you. This is not right, Father. I mean, you can't force a full grown man to get married to someone he has no feelings for. Listen to yourself. Listen to yourself. You have no feeling for her, yet you Got her in, uh, pregnant. Eh? Listen, I have taken my decision and it stands. It's final. You must marry that girl. Now this is not fair. Talking about what is fair. Okay, now. What is fair? I'm asking you, what is fair? Dad, I've sorted the bill out. Everything is in order. I think we can go home now. Oh, thank you very much, my son. Yes, that can be fair. Thank you. I am so happy. I'm happy you're well now, Dad. Let's go home, eh? Huh. Go bring Dad's um, beat and um, his walking stick. Thank you very much. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. <laughs> you liar. <laughs> Your Highness, we are very happy that you are well now. The people of our kingdom were worried and they kept praying for your quick recovery. Now that you are well, Your Highness, Shall we proceed with the presentation? Hmm. Your Highness, you are my friend. And I must be honest with you. 
Thank you. I have no son to present again. My family is torn apart. Your Highness, a solution must be found. Don't let your enemies know no. that the palace is on fire. They will bank on that and take away the throne from this family. But Akuna, what do I do? What do I do? My sons are a disgrace to me and everyone. Your Highness, when the desired is not available, the available becomes desirable. Akuna, in this situation, in this situation, what is the available? Tell me, what is the available? Why are you still crying? Haven't you succeeded with your plans? My plans? What are you talking about? Am I forcing you to marry me? Well, well, your charms are working. My father says I must marry you. So I will. You will? But no, I'm doing it for my father. I never wanted it at all. Never sought to fall for you. I never sought to be your wife. Never planned to be in your world. Um, okay, no. I called you here to find out how you're preparing for the marriage rites. I'm preparing. Does that mean you're ready? Um, if that be the case, how much will the traditional and um, white wedding cost? That I don't know. We'll, we'll sort all that out when the time is right. Listen, Okenna, the sooner you open your mind and embrace this marriage, the better for you. <laughs> you want me to get married to her in three weeks, ain't it? I'll marry her. Well, do what you like. I have decided I'll give you I'll give you a house. I will also give you a car and make you the manager of the new factory that I'm setting up. That way you will not you will be independent and you will not come back to me for money. Well, you better start preparing because um, three weeks is just around the corner. Okay? Every day that goes. Why is my compound not swept yet? There is no time now. I'm fixing your breakfast. Shut up! Don't give me that excuse. My compound should be clean at all times. Come on, honey. It's high time we got a maid or a gate man. Hmm? Yes. And what are you doing in this house? 